The overall goal of this procedure is to demonstrate how to quantify behavioral responses in white sturgeon to sublethal exposure to aqueous copper. This method can help to answer key questions in the ecotoxicology field, such as how sublethal exposure to contaminants affects swimming behavior of fish. This method can provide important information for white sturgeon conservation. It can also be readily applied to other fish species, amphibians and invertebrates. The main advantage of this technique is that the response is highly sensitive, provides an early indication of toxicity, and is relevant to organism survival. Initially, this method may be challenging if the individual is unfamiliar with making behavioral measurements. Demonstrating the protocol will be my co-author, Holly Puglis. First, prepare two liters of aqueous reagent grade copper 2 sulfate pentahydrate. Next, equilibrate the diluter system and exposure tanks. Place the intake tube from the automated syringe dispenser into the stock solution flask. Then, set the automated pump spike volume to 1 milliliter and turn the diluter on. The system makes a 50% dilution series of 5 concentrations and a control. Through a four-way splitter, these solutions are delivered to the four replicate exposure chambers. Next, turn on the pump for the chiller, set to maintain the water bath at 15 degrees Celsius. Now, using the automated timer on the diluter, set it to cycle every 30 minutes. The water level in the tanks is maintained by a standpipe drain. Prepare the exposure chambers by putting a 4-centimeter hole...